hey guys hope you're all well and hope this video finds you well so today we're going to talk about how to become an extrovert so let's get into it so what's an extrovert extrovert as far as i know are people who are very quiet very into their own like they're not so what's the word social they like to stay by themselves so the one i mean as you can tell I'm an extrovert, I'm a yapa yapa, I'm a chata chata, <laughs> you know, <laughs> I love to make friends, I love to talk to people, um, I'm, I'm not loud, but depending on the crowd, I mean, I can be, but anyway, the first point or the first way to become an extrovert is to, is to set yourself practical goals, don't overachieve, okay, don't get, don't go from here to here in a day, it, it, it's just gonna backfire take small steps small steps set yourself practical goals okay for example you if you're at work sometimes the way i am at work sometimes i just see you know if you can't if you can't connect eyes with someone just say hi that's how i am i will say hi good morning so do that okay set yourself that that practical goal for like one time a week or every other day in the week make eye contact with someone or if someone smiles at you say hi you know most people when they walk into work or whatever if you make eye contact they, they will smile at you so if they smile at you say hi how are you or hi good morning that's it keep you moving that's it you don't have to do much just say good morning hi keep you moving because okay? if you do too much you just get overwhelmed you'll be scared you get nervous you just work yourself up and then you won't do it so start with something small okay that is all you need to do. Next time, you never know. They might even ask you your name or start a conversation. And and that's how it starts. You make a friend that you can, you know, you know at work. The other thing is you have to put yourself out there. If you don't put yourself out there, it's not going to happen, baby. Okay, you cannot sit over there on the table by yourself in your phone like this, eating your food and think someone's going to come and talk to you. Unless it's your manager and they need something. But someone is not going to come and talk to you if you're just over there in a the corner looking like you're scared of, you know, some dog is looking at you about to eat you. It can't be like this. You have to get out of your phone and actually look at who's there. Look at the people around you. Okay. If they look at you, as I said, make eye contact. That's one of the things, make eye contact. And then someone will say something, smile at you, say hi. But you cannot sit over there by yourself, head down, and think people are going to talk to you. Put yourself out there. Okay? Yeah? So, and remember, don't force it. Do not force it. And also, do go at your own pace, okay? Don't be going at 100, <laughs> as I said, 100 miles from 0 to 100 miles in a day, like, and i mean you can try it and see it might work for you but the majority of extroverts you it's hard already for them to talk to people okay and then you want to go from zero to a hundred go at your own pace you always have to do something you can't just sit there and people won't do it unless it's your crush and it's almost crushing on you then they'll come in a corner where you're like this and they'll be saying hi and then you'll probably be looking like you know <laughs> it's do something spontaneous so you know that person who you've been saying hi to and good morning you can always go to the i don't know cubicle or whatever at work and be like hey do you want to go for lunch today you know obviously give it a couple of weeks of you guys saying hi and stuff like that and then you can just say oh do you want to go lunch together if they say yes ding 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 result you know and if that works that's your way then you you've got a system of getting out there if that system works of saying hi good morning over a couple of weeks and then after that you ask someone can you you want to go lunch and they say yes that's continue you and if they i mean and if you ask them do you want to go lunch and they say no that day don't revert backwards they might be they, i mean if they tell you i can't today you know they might have a good reason don't be like oh they don't want to be my friend no 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 don't go back to your shell say that's okay we can do another time okay join a club that is one of the best ideas because if it's something that you like doing and you meet other people who like doing that you will automatically start talking they'll start they'll come and start talking to you and then before you know you have a group of friends that you meet up with to go for lunch to go for dinner to go to the movies and that's automatic friends right there from a club 
when you're in a club, you don't even have to try that much because you're all there to do the same thing. So you automatically start talking to each other like, oh my God, have you read this book? Oh my God, did you remember that that that, that passage or whatever that already you're going to be taking each other's numbers by the end of the session. So if you can find a club of something that you like doing, join it join it those are some of the points i thought about that could help someone who's an introvert turn, you know try to be an extrovert you don't have to go all the way left to be an extrovert you can just be in the middle okay you can still be an introvert an extrovert you can just be in the middle you don't always have to be fully this way and fully that way okay this is not what we're trying to do here we just have some you know try to have some friends and these ideas were helpful for you guys and i hope you you're able to use them and help you make some friends okay even one friend is enough you don't need a whole village one is enough okay so i hope you find it helpful and we shall speak to you soon bye